Hey, YouTube viewer, who's if you, who out there knows about Charles Darwin? What is who is Charles Darwin? I've been hearing his name pop up here recently. If you know who Charles Darwin is, give me a shout. I saw something on a couple of videos earlier this evening, and it reminded me of something that I heard about Charles Darwin, and that is that uh, Charles Darwin. Uh, Charles Darwin, is that right? Was a scientist, is that right? Charles Darwin, is it Darwin? Charles Darwin was supposed to be some kind of a scientist and uh, he had a tiny, what, 10 year old girl, 10 year old, 11 year old girl. And she had an unusual type of bone marrow cancer. Apparently he was a, somewhat of a, scientist and he couldn't find a cure for his daughter and his daughter uh passed of course and so like a lot of people when they try to use god as a ace in the hole or as a last ditch effort of i have to call on god whatever well he tried that he thought that God should heal his child, even though he had no relationship with God. Are you like that? You think God ought to do something for you and you ain't got no relationship with him? You don't know anything about him, but you think God should solve all your problems? He thought that. And so when God, uh, you know, every soul does belong to God. You ever met God? Every soul belongs to God. Well, apparently his little girl, uh, God thought she was too, too good for this world, certainly too good for him. And God called her home and he got upset because God called his little girl home. So our, on this particular narrative, I heard that he went to the uh, place called the Isle of Galapagos and put a gun in his mouth and committed suicide. Now, I've also heard that he went to the Isle of Galapagos to supposedly discover something uh to get a physical rever uh, representation of evolution, which is absolutely impossible because there is no, if you go by what they call their basic theory of evolution, which is really just religion because there's no scientific evidence to back up a theory. When people are propagating a theory and trying to make it science, but there's no scientific evidence of that theory or to prove that theory, then it becomes a religion. See, that's why Jesus Christ is not a religion because he is divine. He's the son of the living God. Well, do we have any examples of who he is? Absolutely. You would be one example. I would be another because he created all human beings. So I don't know who this Charles Darwin fellow is, but I can tell you one thing. He put a gun in his mouth and that doesn't sound like a very wise man to me. When your problems seem insurmountable, you need to talk to the only one who can solve your problem. He's bigger than your problem. He sits above the heavens. And if you don't believe in him, now maybe you, are you one of the redeemed? You could be one of the redeemed and don't even know it. But if, when your problems seem insurmountable, the only one that can help you is God. Have you ever met God? <laughs> This fellow sure is it up.